I think one thing I really appreciated about Sarah was how she refused to be defined by anything, whether it was illness or her life stage being single or um, not having physical children, any of those things. She just refused that and found joy in spite of those things. And I think even though we didn't have the same struggle as Sarah, all of us have things in our lives that could confine us if we let them. And whenever I would feel something closing in on me, I would think about Sarah and how she very easily could have even let the four walls of her house be confining, but she chose joy and freedom anyway. And that a lot of times still gives me the courage to do the same thing, to say, if Sarah could do that, then I can too.